where are we today, Simon? We are at the Watergrass Line. At the moment, we're at Alsford Station. Also known as the Mid Hance Railway, we're going to be riding some train. Oh, yeah. Here you can see a Class 8 diesel shunter known as Phoenix. And well, it's maybe it's a on... Class 12, 4, 11 or... Well, yes, it's one of those Class 8 family, isn't it? I'm not actually sure if it's an 8, 9, 10, 11, 12... I don't think it's a 13, because that's two of them coupled together, isn't it? And it's coupled currently to Hammy the Hampshire unit, which we've ridden on before when we've been here, but I don't think he's running today. The it's one bit... we've ridden on before was the red one. No, it was green. It was this one. But it's a bit of a rainy day here at Arnsford today. And our train is due to come in in about 10 minutes. Who can work out what time of loco it is? Uh, it looks like it's a... It's a tender loco, right? Yeah, it is. I believe it's a, it's a Q1 of schools. I don't think it's a Q1, because there's only one of those in preservation, and that's in the National Well Museum. Yeah, and there is a school here, but I don't think it's in ticket at the moment. So no, but I, I can think see it's a gonna school. Be... It is a school. I don't think it is. I think it's going to be... It's a southern loco. Nice. You no, again. There's only one team up to now. I think I'm right. I think it's going to be the U, uh, S class or N class, something like that. You see, right in the cabin here. Wonderful. Oh, look at the fire! That's fantastic. No, it's not. It is number five zero six. I'm filming it. No, no, not yet. It's going to reverse round first. We've got lots more we can film happening up here. And I'm going to uncouple it. It's going to come this side of me. Yeah. What kind of loco is it, Simon? It's an S15, and I can tell because of the wicket wheel configuration and the number. Because what? the wheel configuration is a 460, and the number is 506. I've seen it on the, I've seen it on the Diesel Gala video. Ah. And link up there. Well, it's to just the about video. to move. Here it goes. What do you reckon, Simon? Good. Smart. Now let's get on the train. Oh, yeah. You can come on the other side of it if you want. So I can keep it in shot longer this way.
Beautiful. Nearly time to go. Getting ready to see the train leave. Here we go. Alton. Although it's the one o'clock. One o'clock departure from Arlswood for Alton. Calling it Ropley and Medstead and Four Miles. Here we go. I'll just fall until we get on the So it is running into three coaches today. Is it three? One, two, it might be four actually, we might four. Four coaches, we're in. I wish I could share that smell with you. There's some more locos are stored up here in the storage siding. There's a 50, 7, great man. Cheltenham, school star, gunpowder man, fully attender. You've just eaten a cream egg, and now you've got your mouth full of cream egg and can't speak. <laughs> Are you saying it was digital? <laughs> Simon, now you're eating a Bakewell slice. Is it tasty? <laughs>
You are now approaching the strong, strong entry. entry. Oh, there's another train leaving. Yeah, it's one on the far side, so unfortunately, you can just see, see it through the windows. Oh, you've got crumbs all over your face. Dramatic zoom in, brush off the crumbs, dramatic zoom out. Should we fill in the points, Simon? <laughs> Point at them or something. They're going to change in a minute. Oh, here we go. Points changed. And the catch point has changed up there as well. This is a catch point, and that means it's a safety measure so that uh, if a train goes over that point when it's set the wrong way, it'll come off the rails rather than damage other railway infrastructure, I think is the idea. up there. I think there's a water tower up there. I often see they go up a long way. They can take on water before it comes back. Good yeah. stuff. Yeah. So you stay well back from the platform edge, Simon. Stay well back from the platform edge because the S15 number 506 Southern is coming in and it will be really close to the platform. You so will. please ensure that all your personal luggage stays away from the edge of the platform. Thank you. Let's go and see them couple up. Yeah. <laughs> this is my favourite part. Yeah, tightening up the coupling. Try warming up. Uh, what is a train? It's a series of interconnected vehicles, often running on rails, powered by an Esther Snorris. We're now coming in to Medstead and Four Marks. Four marks. Look, four marks. Would you always a good one? I opened the window. Yeah, you did. Sticking is clear. And any moment now. Guys, that was whistle. a feeble whistle. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's the um. It's fell on the platform here. He does all the YouTube content for. Um, Midhouse Railway. I recognise his face. Well, well then I'm going to. their YouTube channel. You can give him a wave. Watercrest Films, you need know, it heading back towards Ropley. Which we're going to get off to have a look at the sheds. And don't worry, we are not going to miss the train exactly. 
we're going to technically miss the train because we're going to get off, look round, and then the train will leave. And then the, tra the same train, because there's only one engine running today, will come back and collect us after an hour. So that should give us enough time to want to look out round at the exhibits. Say what you see. over the works here. On what, the viewing gallery. We'll film the viewing gallery. Watch this loco closest to us, Simon. Thomas. Yeah, it is Thomas. He's a little bit dismantled for a major overhaul, but you can just about make out his blue and red livery. Yeah. And then can you remember what the what we had just in front of Thomas? A uh, bully tender. That's right at the front. So this is the Canadian Pacific tender. Oh, yeah. And Canadian Pacific has gone elsewhere for the rest of its major restoration. Oh, yeah. Just in front of that, I think it was a standard four tender. tender here. And you can see lots of other bits. We've got the, the frames for the tender here and, and the wheels for the tender. And right at the front there, the frames for the standard four itself in front of those cranes. And over this side, the wheel sets for the standard four. So it's in lots of parts at the moment. Amazing to think how it'll all go back together and make a full loco. Pretty impressive, right, Simon? Yeah. There's three different sets of wheels, Simon, and only one is going to make it to the end of this sloping section track without falling off. Here's wheel set number one. No. Nope. No, not that one. Okay, put that to one side. Try a different one. Always looking good. Ah. Oh. So it must be. Well, actually, it should have been those. Try the third one, see what happens with the third one. Probably the same. No, definitely not those ones. Try set two again, just make sure they're right in the middle. And release. Excellent. And why do these ones stay on the track when the other ones don't? That's and that has an opposite wheel yeah. flange, and this has the correct wheel flange. Yeah, it's flanges, that's right. Keeps them on that's, the rails. That's the sound you hear when the, you hear the squeal, like the tss, tss. That's flange squeal from the flanges, because the curves are too tight for the wheels. You said it. So we're going round the back of that shed where they're working on engines to see the other engines that are behind the shed. Nice. I don't know what we're going to see, but this Hopefully it will be interesting. This is looking inside the box from the, the other, other end. It's Canadian Pacific's tender there. See and it here much you better. can see the frames and wheels of the 4MT. And, and there's the Thomas standard tank. 
Or maybe it's tanks. Someone says tanks are here, yeah. So this is just Davin parts. <laughs> and there's a 47 there as well. Let's go and have a look at the oh. Apparently this is a class 13 diesel trader. Here's some faces of uh, Thomas some Thomas characters stored here. Good, right, Good. Simon. Yeah. We're going to get on it. That's why we're on this platform. We're going to get on right at the back, and then hopefully we'll be right at the front when it turns around and comes back the other way. Let's hope it stops with that. Here it will. Do. I'm following you. Great. Let's get on. I just saw that brakes yeah. just go onto oh. the wheels. That would have been a cool. Can you camber up, Simon? Look at me. Do you need some help? No, not at all. Are you sure? It's a big step. Well, well done. Let's go right here. Good idea. Not there because that's the a very bit back. How about this side? Yeah. Yeah. Small. You had a good day, Simon? Yeah. Yeah. So it does. It doesn't get much better than that. Simon. 